Well, someone is suing Warner Brothers to prove that ghosts are real. They're saying that The Conjuring was based on real events. Uh, they, they can win that. All I have to do is testify. <laughs> <laughs> How can it be that easy? Well, the Warner Brothers are already dead. <laughs> <laughs> God, I hope we never get sued. Oh, uh, we won't. We're completely honest. We only use 100% genuine, real, talking beavers. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Chew on This. <laughs> So, have you ever seen a ghost? Uh, I thought I did once, but it was near Red Deer, so it was probably a clan member. Oh. <laughs> hey. Hey. Yeah, hey! I'm on go. your side, brother. Don't worry, we'll go, we'll go, we'll go back over there. We'll go back over there and see if we can find them. We'll go back yeah. over there. Oh, no, no, for sure. I've seen, yeah, I've definitely seen ghosts. Like, yeah, yeah I've seen ghosts. I think so. I, I swear I did, but then my therapist gave me a science-y answer of why that's impossible, so I don't know anymore. <laughs> so what would you do if you were a ghost, Billy? Uh, hang around pottery classes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Ha ha ha. If I was a ghost, I would uh, do the remake of uh, Ghost but with Kate Upton this time. Oh, yeah. good Gotta taste. think ahead. Gotta think ahead. <laughs> I, me, I just, I just creating pranks like all over the place. I just be yeah. doing pranks right. Have a left. good old laugh. Oh yeah, all day. Yeah, all day. <laughs> me too. I'd be like just being a dick to people. And <laughs> <laughs> fun. So, is there anything you can do to protect yourself from ghosts, Billy? Yeah, I, I think you pray extra hard or something. Pray extra hard. Yeah, Jesus will save you from them. <laughs> Somewhere in that book. Yeah, G Jesus is ghost. Jesus is ghost. Pray the ghost away. Yeah. Well, well, they say that uh, ghosts are used to like commonality. So if if they're used to something common, basketball players they're gonna be around basketball player. If you're thinking some messed up thought, they're gonna try to be around your thought. So I don't know. Be you. Be as you as possible. Mm -hmm. And we're Old Spice. I hear they don't like. Uh, <laughs> they don't like Old Spice. They're not a Old Spice fan. I'm gonna switch to Old Spice. <laughs> That's a load off my mind. That's <laughs> I heard uh, a lady once told me that if I felt that there was a ghost that I'm supposed to put my shoes at the end of the bed that I'm going to wear the next day and turn them in different directions. It confuses the ghost and they leave you alone. Oh. It also works on dates, I found out. <laughs> <laughs> so should this be a lawsuit or, I mean, it's all in good fun. This is just a movie, a ghost movie, right? Everyone loves the, a good old-fashioned horror film. I, th I think the lawsuit is just good publicity. I mean, we're talking about it. Yeah, yeah, that is Good true. Point. No such thing as bad publicity. Mm -hmm. For sure. Yeah, I think they're saying that uh, they say that it's based on true events. So as long as they can prove that one of those events happened, how can they sue them? It doesn't well, have to be the ghost part. Be the and people part. are stupid, so they'll believe anything. Yeah. And I mean, it's based on true events. I was yeah. dumb enough I like to how think she it was a ghost. Right in the eye. <laughs> <laughs> and it, it, it is America. Eh? It is America. Yeah. America. America. So if you were to die today, what would your unfinished business be? Deleting my browser history. <laughs> I knew you were going to yeah. say something like that. Yeah, I uh, guess it would be not I'm making screwed. the NHL. Mm. Yeah. Oh, look at me. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even be a ref at this size. Okay? Is that the National Hot Dog League? <laughs> <laughs> I'm already running that one. You're in first, first yeah. place. It's all good. I got you. I got you. Oh, uh, you know what? I think I would, uh, my, I got a little girl. So Aww. my unfinished business would be seeing her grow up, become a young, Aww. beautiful, intelligent lady, yeah. you know? So Taking over the world, yeah. pinky in the brain style. <laughs> all right. <laughs> I've right. done that yet. Eventually. Eventually. Oh, it's time for our hot button question. <laughs> so if you could come back and haunt someone, who would it be and how? I, I think it would be my grandmother because she had dementia and heard voices. And then when she sees me, she would know that she was okay. So... <laughs> Yeah, I thought about that one. <laughs> it's very kind. It's very kind. I, I've been thinking about this one. I have a high school coach, football coach, that he made me run a play I didn't want to play. I, I run a play I didn't want to run. So I went right instead of left. So I would haunt him for the rest of his days. Whenever he wants to go left, I make him go right. And whenever he wants to go right, I make him go left. You know? and yeah. Yeah, just torment Show the him. hell out of him. Mm -hmm. Probably my family, including my cat. Just so I could be dicks to them and love them forever and enjoy them. <laughs> enjoy their fear. <laughs> well, don't forget to like, share, That's and subscribe wicked. three times in the mirror or Billy's gonna haunt you. Bye.